Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to see how to scrap the Instagram uh, followers count using a Google Apps script. And here is the list of um, Instagram profile. Um, these are all the Bollywood uh, heroes profile. So this is a Shah Rukh Khan profile. And if you see here, he has around 521 post, 18.6 million followers, and he's following the six person. So let's see how to get uh, this follow account. So if we can able to get the follow account, you can apply the same logic to scrap whatever details you want from this profile. So go to the Google Sheet and Tools and Script Editor. So it will open up blank my function and we are not going to use the Google URL fish method because if you use that and if you try to make a request after two or three requests you will be blocked by Google. So there is a trusted third party website it offers a scrapping service and with the help of that third party API we are going to fetch the follow account. I have given a link in the YouTube description you need to get an API key from that website and you just need to follow along the tutorial because I'm using my personal API so I cannot able to share so once you get your personal API key you can just follow me along first we will uh, make a get request in the postman API to scrap the HTML content of this page and and we can see how to scrap the follow accounts from the postman API response so go to the postman and here you need to put the API key and the URL it accept basically accept uh, two things uh, one is an API key and another one is a URL and in the URL you have to put the Instagram profile URL so once you put that click on a send so make sure that you have selected a get not a post and the entity URL here and click on send so if you see here you got the HTML as a response and let's copy this one if you click on that it will make a copy of that so go to regex So we are going to scrap the Instagram followers count using a regex. So just delete that one and replace it with the HTML that you got. So just search here for the follow account. So if you see here, you can find the follow account here as well as here. So this one seems to be unique when compared to this metadata because we have a something unique property called OG colon description. So let's take this one to find the follow account. So go here and just remove this stuff. Make sure that you select the expression flag case insensitive as well. So paste that one. So if you see here, there is a one match you can see the match here and we need to scrap up to followers so put dot star and followers so it should scrap from here to here but unfortunately it's showing the no result the reason is we are having a spaces as well as a line tab so we need to get rid of all these things so to avoid that just copy this one and you can use any online tools or if you have an inbuilt app that should remove uh, unwanted spaces and line break that should be fine so i'm using a text fixer to resolve that so it's an uh, basically a online tool that will help you to remove the unwanted paragraphs and spaces so if you see here remove line breaks just click on that i want to remove a line break and paragraph break so just copy the entire html from here to here and click on the remove line break that's it you will get 
the newly formatted HTML, copy and go to the regex, delete the one and put it over here. Now you can see that it's showing the followers count as we want. So this is the exact regex we want to scrap the follower count. So with that, we can go ahead and start write the script. So let's create a variable with URL1 and this URL1 is referring to the scrapper URL. So I'm going to copy up to this one and the URL2 I'm going to put what is the Instagram profile that I want to scrap. So let's combine and make it as final URL. So it should be something URL1 plus URL2 for concatenating these two URLs. So next one you have to get or fetch the HTML content of this profile. So to do that, create a variable called something like get content. So we need to use a class URL fetch app and fetch method and this fetch method accept a parameter pass this final URL as a parameter here and get the entire text. So now we'll remove the unwanted paragraph unwanted spaces as well as a line breaks using a method called trim so now we will get the raw html like this and let's store the follower regex in the new variable so just copy this one and paste it here that's it so you need to enclose that within backslash followed by GA so G stands for global and I for case insensitive so now we will match this HTML content with a follower regex to get the follower count so let's see how to do that so you need to take the HTML content and you need to match the HTML content against this regex expression. That's it and let's print that one and see how it works. Let's execute this function. Go to view logs. So if you see here, we got the exact a result as shown in the regex R. So now from here, let's see how we can filter further and take only this follow account. So this regex expression a return array. Let me create a new variable called followers. Since it a return an array. I need to take the very first index so I put zero here and I can use a replace method to replace the unwanted text with a null value so these are all the unwanted text so I'm going to remove that one Okay, so it's because it already contained double quotes and we are using double quotes again. So to avoid that, we can switch to single quotes. Let's save that one. And print the follow account. Now let's see whether we scrap the exact follow account or not. So if we go to view logs, so we got the exact follow account from the Instagram profile. So you can use the same approach to scrap the
the post count, following count, or whatever the details that you want to scrap from this particular page. So let's scrap another person profile. Let's scrap the American profile. So all we need to do is just replace the URL too. That's it. No other change. And click on the execute. Good view logs. And if you see here, he has 2.8 million followers. So let's cross check by looking at his profile. So he got exactly 2.8 million followers. That's it. We are done with a scrapper. So if you want to explore uh, further about this third party API, I have given a documentation link as well. So you can go through what else you can do uh, with this uh, API. So even you can scrap uh, JavaScript, you can render the header as well using this uh, scrapper API, using this API. So that's it for this video. If you have any doubt, just let me know or if you want to scrap some other website, just drop the website link in the comment. Definitely I will consider creating a video for that. Thank you. Bye-bye. Take care.